I think a new development in stage three non-small cell lung cancer is the use of adjuvant immunotherapy, durvalumab, and it has been shown to improve both PFS and overall survival, uh, and also to reduce the incidence of brain metastasis. But we know from the metastatic disease that especially uh, patients with an oncogenic driver associated with non-smoking, so for example, EGFR mutations, ALG rearrangements, uh, ROS1 rearrangement, don't benefit from uh, immunotherapy. And recently, um, uh, a retrospective series was published in the European, Cancer, European Journal of Cancer, uh, showing in a small group of patients uh, that except for KRAS mutations, patients with an oncogenic driver don't seem to benefit from adjuvant immunotherapy. And I think that's important because so far uh, we didn't do a molecular profile in stage three non-small cell lung cancer, but these data at least hint that we should do it and that we should tailor the adjuvant therapy according to the uh, molecular status of the tumor.